Let's talk about what's been trending since yesterday, by the way, guys. Mm. You guys have heard about the arrest of um, internet or rather social media skit maker, uh, what's the name again, The General, mm. Mm -hmm. um, from I think two nights ago, which has blown uh, Instagram up. Now, it's one thing for the agency, that's the NDLEA, to be doing its job. It's another thing for um, individuals to call foul. And this is what's been happening. I have plenty of reservations. If you didn't know, um, uh, um, the general was arrested at his home uh, after a search. And he was uh, found well, with some paraphernalia and also drugs in his possession. However, there's so much that's been coming off of this one story. Mm -hmm. um, and the way I see it, um, the, the, from the video that was taken during the incident, I thought the NDLEA were within their rights to do what they did all mm. through. Mm. And I have uh, other bits that I want to talk about, but I'll let you know. Based on what we saw, because mm. uh, it seemed like uh, that was just up at about the end of the altercation, the part mm. of video we saw, I, I, maybe they probably would have been recording before then because there was a female NDLEA officer yeah. who probably maybe looked like she was maybe the second in command. I think she had a boss because there, there was some reference to your yeah. boss or something, somewhere around there, mm -hmm. you know. And then she goes to the, um, she, 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 she's very calm mm -hmm. in that video. She was very calm. She says, uh, we came here to do our job or something. And it I think it's illegal. It refers to the fact that you can't even you be, be recording or uh, doing a video. You know, and, uh, but it wasn't a general recording because we saw him in shot. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then we, some, uh, some perceived uh, case of uh, uh, domestic violence against the recorder because yeah. we saw the phone. Yeah. Uh, bowing to the <laughs> precepts of the, <laughs> of the slap or the knuckle, or whatever, or it was. Or whatever. So well, we know something happened because the phone tumbled yeah. and then we had some yeah. scuffle and tussles, you know, mm -hmm. in the background. Mm -hmm. But according to the statement the NDLEA uh, put out, they said mm -hmm. they got to the house. Someone was with drugs and ran into the house. Yeah. They got there that they submitted themselves for a search. Yeah. So that you don't have an issue of uh, we planted something, mm -hmm. you know, and they were searched and allowed in. So, but as the, you know, altercation, it, it now started becoming violent, according to, yeah. you know, from what I, we I saw. I am confused about one thing, however. What is the, what's the process with warrants in Nigeria? Do the they warrants, work yeah. Out? Okay, so, I, I, I think. Wait for just swallow speech. <laughs> <laughs> the lawyer in the house. I'm not, yeah. I'm not even get to you. Warrant, need a warrant, but <laughs> if, I, if I was chasing, if I was chasing a criminal, let's yes. say if I was chasing a criminal and a person ran into somewhere, yeah. it's an active, uh, investigation inve active chasing that, uh, active uh, car scene yeah, yeah, something like I'm that good, yeah. so in that case uh, you need a pay, I will now lead the person <laughs> go and go and look no, no, for Winfrey no, no. but see I'll carry Winfrey to court see, if, the person say, Winfrey, ran, warrant, if the person ran into active. Winfrey's house oh uh, would I need Winfrey? Would I need a warrant? Would I? Okay, would somebody I need... entered here. Oh, I do have warrant, but I'm chasing that person. But then again, it kind of like shifted to uh, let's leave that person. That's uh, a you different people, situation. Yeah. If it's a chase mm -hmm. at that point, that means there's something the guy is running from. He's obviously aware, right? And of course, people are on his tail, right? At that point, I doubt you need a warrant to mm. search the house. However, you are meant to cooperate with officials mm -hmm. of the law exactly in do you understand you in, should definitely, in such a scenario in such a situation i am meant to actually present whoever i was who the runner and the runny was, was okay. you understand and bring them out to answer to whatever they are running from but in this case it didn't the seem situation like it was... where you need a warrant is where okay all things we, we, there's some information mm -hmm. independent of any yeah. actual um scene action at that point at that and point. then you are per person's house then or the car or the property then you have to present a warrant before you can search the house mm. okay but not in a so in this instance, right. it would like, seem yeah. that he actually, uh, um, he, he owned up and said that whatever was found inside of his house was his, the drugs mm -hmm. and the paraphernalia. Mm -hmm. Yeah, actually, he, yeah, actually, actually, he, he, yes, yeah. he actually However, came out right after that, that there was this Twitter buzz where, wow. mm -hmm. and this is the, the normal thing with Nigerian use. Yeah. We like to play the victim. The victim, yeah. yeah. A bit sure. too much. And if there's one thing that youth can do, it is gather support. Mm -hmm. Once he comes out and says that, this guy, this guy all, all this and all of that, yeah. he is 22, yeah. according yeah. to him. Yeah. 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 These guys are young. They're very young these Apparently. days. Mike, no, don't worry. Don't be jealous. 22. <laughs> don't be jealous. Like, it's okay. <laughs> but no, the, no, with that, you are jealous. Like <laughs> don't be jealous, Mike. <laughs> How, I, I, I just, I can't stand it anymore. <laughs> this um, always crying foul. <laughs> Um, even yeah. after you have been uh, um, noted to be guilty for uh, so that's the thing. Another that. thing you need to understand the space he's in. Also, he's a social media skit maker, mm -hmm. and we all know how they have a cult-like following or a pretty mm -hmm. strong yeah. following. Do you understand? And no matter what, 
in Nigeria, let's be honest, honest, we don't take police as our friend. So even mm -hmm. when like they're actually doing their the job, right, we exactly. always find a way to make it seem as if they're doing that's something it. wrong. That's it. Yeah. So, yeah. That's yeah. With the normalization of drugs, no matter how small it's also yeah. it's, it's it's a bad thing. When I saw the yeah. list of drugs, I'm like, eh, uh, okay. Yeah, so that many that All a right. number of people all have access to the uh, drug. But you cannot uh, get it from you should, you should mm -hmm. not get it from a pharmacy without prescription. That's yeah. trauma Yeah, so yeah. there is access. Yeah, there is and then access. cannabis there is also. Access. I mean, it's illegal. I know if you're in Canada, you can use cannabis. There are some countries that yeah. uh, cannabis is illegal. But for now, in, in Nigeria, it is it's not. Really illegal. Illegal. Um, however, there are bigger Nigeria pushes out there. Let me use the word pushes. There are people who I think the NDLEA should be going after. And these little guys, these end users, this can maybe not so much but it's still very, illegal very, very in true. any so case cut it off from the source yes actually, cut it off from the exactly actually. thank you cut it off from the source uh, tell us what you guys think is the hashtag wake up nigeria on tvc we would like to see your comments and maybe make references to them as the show goes, uh, yep. goes on we'll be back mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.